Hello, welcome back to Structural Analysis Made Fun and Easy. I'm just checking up on my answers. Uh, so I got there was a free um, plane frame analysis program on the uh, web called Sky Sib. So I just ran the program through that. Um, so um, I need to revise my correct my answer so I would redo the video I'm sure that my 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 methodology is correct I've just made a mistake in the in the arithmetic because um, so the answers are a I oh sorry B B D equals 35.896 compression whereas I had uh, 38.872 so it's close very close but not just a little bit out and then BC is tension 27.953 whereas I had 30.56 so I've just made a little 4 kilonewtons out so was, um, and then so I was just checking before I finished it off so if you guys are interested and then so um, B, BD, BD is 75.912 um, A D is 72.686 compression because you've got the 40 here so it's asymmetric and uh, the tension load for A D is 56.782 not sure about the displacement let's just have a quick look on the displacement oh there we go oh yeah like so it moves like that if I just turn the actuators off oh yeah I don't, I'm not sure. I'm not. That value might not isn't necessarily correct because uh, I didn't put the member properties in. I was just giving it out of interest so you can see that because it's not restrained, that's moving. So uh, that's that's and it's asymmetric. So that is. Uh, but anyway, that's the. That's the actual forces. There shouldn't be any moment. Oh wait a minute. Sorry, that's, oh, that's. I need to check that. But I'm sure the. Oh uh, uh, yeah, some shear forces there as well. That's from the. Um, yeah, uh, the mercury minus. I need to check that. I'm sure the actual forces are right though. Thirty-five point eight nine six, twenty-seven point nine five three, seventy-five point nine one two, seventy-two. Um, so hopefully you found this useful. Uh, obviously I need to go back and uh, check over the arithmetic I did in my other videos. So I'll do that as soon as possible. But I'm sure that the techniques that I've used are correct. The methodology is right. It's just made a mistake on the um, on the uh, arithmetic. So uh, please bear with me and I'll get that sorted out. I hope you found it interesting. Please uh, see you in the next video. Thanks.